Hey guys! I feel like it's been so long, but um, it is what it is. For those coming back, welcome back, guys! For those just tuning in for the first time, hola! So, by the title of this video, you already know what's happening. It's another poppy. It's another gift set. I'm excited. Now, before we get into this video and before I take out of the box and we do all this other stuff, I want to let you know that I also purchased the extra bodies. So when I do my like individual looks, I will, they'll be in the individual bodies. So maybe I'll do like a group shot of all three of them together at some point um, to kind of get a vibe of all the looks together. But any hoot, enough of that. Let's get this box going. Here it is. Oh, that was heavy. It just hit me. Ow. I feel like it's been such a long time since I've done a gift set. Although the last Poppy video, which was technically my first Poppy video, was a gift set. It was two girls and one. Oh, well. Maybe I'm delusional. Ooh, so I see we're still keeping with the same Poppy box. And by the same, I mean the colors. Giving you that pink, giving you that orange, giving you that gold. Very Tory Burch. I don't shop there. I wouldn't know. Oh, bitch. Yes, girl. Yes. Talk about it. Look at it. Isn't it stunner? Oh, love it. Don't want the turn like a little weird, but you know. It is what it is, because, well, she ain't got a full body in there. Oh, this redhead, though, I didn't think she would be such a stunner in person. I'm, like, loving her a little more than I thought I would. Hmm. Interesting. So I'm, like, distracted. I'm, like, really... I'm taken back. I just love the lip color and the red hair. So much is happening. Oh can't handle it anyways guys so for those that have been to my channel you know that I like to unbox style off camera um for those that are new now you know what I'm about to do so without further ado I'll be right back in a few seconds okay Okay guys, so here's poppy number one so I decided to kind of switch the head hair face makeup looks with different outfits and we're not in the promo i figured you know if i'm gonna like restyle them and give them all their own body why not give them a little different of an identity so i decided to go with the blonde for what i'm gonna call the school girl pop look she's getting that soda pop on her lunch break mm-hmm there isn't really much to this girl i mean just really straightforward. The flats are adorable though. Can we like take a moment? Look how cute that pointiness is, y'all. And we can never have enough soda bottles, right? Y'all. Let's get a close up of this face, okay? So clean, so pretty. Are her eyes, <gasps> stop it, her eyes are green. The other girls have like blue eyes. Oh, so killer. Love it. I love when they have different eye colors. Look at how beautiful the texture of the sweater comes on this camera. I've never noticed that. But anywho, there is poppy number one in what I'm calling look number one. The Scoop Girl Soda Pop moment. Oh, okay. And then here is poppy number two. So this is the lingerie set in the gift set. Um, beautiful little lavender with the most cutest little slippers and pumps. Adorbs! Um, the fabric of this top is just stunning. It just feels so nice on it. And, um, this face, this is the face in the unboxing that I was just completely, like, caught off guard by. Like, I just didn't think I was gonna love it so much. A little disappointed that her eyes are not a different color. Like, I would have loved her to have the green eyes. Just a personal thing. But the Xinyong, we have to talk about it. It's just perfection. 
simply the most perfect chignon ever. Um, but yeah, guys, so here is look number two. Really simple, really straightforward, but you know, still makes an impact because it's just so clean in the throwback. Beauty! Oh my god, guys, wait, hold on. Just realized. I don't know if you could see the focus coming off. The little bracelet has a bow. So cute. All right, look number two. And here we have look three. So I decided to do the ball gown with the blue hair just to kind of like play around with it as you already know with the other girls. But this right here is the ensemble that kind of made me really press the purchase button. It's just such an iconic kind of very Audrey Hepburn throwback. So clean but so funky. The accessories are like timeless. It's like the most perfect opera look. Just, uh, you know, now that I said opera, it's kind of give me a little Anastasia vibe because, I mean, her dress is a little bit like non-ball gown, but it was gorge. Um, and then she has the more like simple lip nude. Also, guys, can we get into these earrings? Get into these earrings. Get into these earrings. <sighs> gorge. Just gorge. Love it. Also, um, FYI, this hair gelled. Gelled to the gods. It is so stiff. I refuse to touch it any further. She's kind of giving me like Jeannie in a bottle kind of vibes. So blue, so pretty. Okay, guys, and as mentioned, here are all three poppies in all ensembles, side to side, just so you can get like a full vibe. So, like I mentioned earlier, I got the bodies just so. We can get that moment of all of them together and just to see how they complement each other, how different they are from each other. Um, and the best thing about Poppy is always she's in that era and she lives in it. It just, you know, yells. 1960s funk. Mm hmm Funky. Just funky. 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 Oh, you know what I realized now that we've done this group shot? I've not shown you the shoes over here. They're rather simple. I feel like we've seen these before in Poppy, but there they go. There they are, guys. All three girls. Just screaming perfection. Y'all. Okay, guys. So that was my review on the Poppy Parker. Lots of looks. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Hope it was, you know entertaining is what I'm aiming for here. Um, once again, thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to like it. Oh, girl. And um, I'm ready. I'm ready for whatever's coming. Also, I can now officially say my ticket has been paid for. I see you at the convention. It is official. Okay. I should probably start making like a countdown calendar. Do you have one? If you do, please share with me because uh, I want to do one. I think it, you know, do a little like clock time thing. Okay, I'm I'm distracted in my own head. Anyways, thank you much for watching. Bye.